10 celebs who gave up fame to work normal jobs. Flashing lights, beautiful gowns, and incredible roles. Who would want to give that up? Well, apparently, some celebrities preferred normal jobs to their glamorous and overactive Hollywood lifestyle. With fame comes problems, from the invasion of privacy to fans hurdling all around to sneak a selfie. A celebrity lifestyle can be nerve-wracking, so in this video, let's take a look at the 10 celebrities who gave up fame to work normal jobs. 10. Jack Gleason Starting the list is the actor who played the unanimously hated Joffrey in the ever-so-popular TV show Game of Thrones, Jack Gleason. Landing one of the most memorable roles in TV history must have been a lot of pressure, especially for the young 19-year-old Jack who didn't have a lot of experience acting. After Jack became a recognizable face in the industry, he decided acting wasn't his passion anymore and retired from the performing arts after Joffrey was killed off in 2014. As of 2020, Jack graduated from Trinity College in Dublin and has stated he would love to enrich studies and eventually get a PhD. 9. Nikki Blonsky Then 21-year-old Nikki Blonsky was introduced to the world with her debut film Hairspray. In 2007, Hollywood was ready to welcome a talented actress and singer to their list of stars. Nikki even got a Golden Globe nomination for her portrayal of Tracy Turnblad in the musical film. But after no other role could amount to her past success, Nikki decided to say goodbye to the glamorous lifestyle. She later pursued a career in cosmetology, earning her certificate in 2011. She has since settled down in New York City and works in a hair salon, giving people beautiful makeovers. And even though we may not see a huge comeback from Nikki, it is a shame to see such a talented actress leave the film industry. 8. Frankie Muniz From Malcolm in the Middle to driving race cars, Frankie Muniz comes in at number 8. As one of the most popular and high-achieving child actors of his generation, no one could have predicted that Frankie would one day leave the limelight. From his Emmy and Golden Globe nominations, Muniz was the poster child of early success and fame. But in 2006, after Malcolm in the Middle finished, he joined Jensen Motorsport as a race car driver. He even competed in the Champ Car World Series. But after suffering a serious car crash that resulted in two mini strokes, Frankie backed away from his fast cars and decided to choose an even more rock and roll job, playing the drums in a band. In 2012, Muniz joined Kingsfoil and rocked on stage before his departure in 2014. Who knew Malcolm was such a cool dude? 7. Vanilla Ice Up next at number 7 is Ice Ice Baby, Vanilla Ice. Thanks to his iconic rap single, Robert Van Winkle, <laughs> or as the whole world got to know him as Vanilla Ice, became the 1990s music star. He even received a Grammy nomination for Best Rap Solo Performance. But as fame slowly drifted away from the artist, he decided to take a different career path, renovating and selling houses. Vanilla Ice has been in the real estate industry for some time now, even having his own reality TV series, The Vanilla Ice Project, where he renovated homes. But if that wasn't enough, he also published a real estate guide on how to successfully buy and flip a house. So if you're thinking of selling or buying a house, take advice from the Ice Ice Baby singer. 6. Dylan Sprouse Coming in at number 6 is one of the most famous Hollywood twins of all time, Dylan and Cole Sprouse. These brothers have been acting on the Disney Channel ever since they were 13 years old and to this day remain one of the most recognizable twins in TV history. But after their Sweet Life movie ended, the brothers decided to attend New York University and focus on their studies. After graduating in 2015, Cole returned to acting and is now one of the stars on the popular Riverdale teen drama, while Dylan has said no thank you to the limelight. Dylan, alongside his partners, opened up a bar in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, where he works as a brewmaster. If you're in the Big Apple and want to drink a cool beer on a hot summer day, make sure you stop by his brewery and say hi to the former Disney Channel star. 5. Freddie Prince Jr. A true 90s heartthrob, Freddie Prince comes in next at number 5. Most of us remember the actor from the classics I Know What You Did Last Summer and She's All That, as well as his guest appearances on Friends and 24. But did you know the successful actor is now a chef? The actor, writer, producer, and WWE enthusiast finally decided to settle down and choose one career to pursue. He was actually set to study in culinary school before he landed his first acting gig, so his sudden career change doesn't come as that much of a shock. The now chef Freddie has even released a cookbook back to the kitchen that includes 75 delicious recipes anyone can try today. Love cooking? Test out some of his food and make sure you leave a bite for us. 4. John Gosselin 
From co-parenting eight children with his then-wife, Kate Gosselin, to playing at nightclubs, John Gosselin made quite a turn in his career. After filing for divorce, John stepped away from their reality TV show, John and Kate Plus Eight, and has been hiding low ever since. Their divorce drama was highly publicized and everyone wondered what the father of sex tuplets and twins would do next. As any parent will tell you, raising children is neither easy nor cheap, so John had to make ends meet. After working as a cook and server at various restaurants in Pennsylvania, he finally settled down and became a DJ playing in nightclubs and bars. Whatever pays the bills, right John? 3. Kevin Jonas Often regarded as the least popular and famous Jonas, Kevin Jonas is next on our list. The Jonas Brothers first debuted on our TV screens and radios in 2007, and after a couple of years being apart and on hiatus, they finally reunited in 2019. While the band was officially broken up, Nick and Kevin still remain in the music game, both releasing their individual albums, but the oldest, Kevin, decided to try a normal life for once, away from the flashing cameras and screaming fans. During their hiatus, Kevin became quite an entrepreneur. He currently co-owns Jornis Werner Homes, a custom home building company, and even released an app that allows you to scout cool restaurants around your area. I guess the break was exactly what Kevin needed. 2. Hayden Christensen How many stories have you heard about a successful Hollywood actor suddenly owning and running a farm? We only know the story of Hayden Christensen and how the Star Wars star became a farmer. Golden Globe and Screen Actors Guild Award nominations just weren't enough for Hayden, so the Canadian actor decided to step back and focus on his true passion. In 2008, after buying land in Ontario, he started working on his own farm, learning about livestock and crops in the meantime. But as most actors do, he briefly returned on our screens in 2017 and 2018. As of 2020, the actor-turned-farmer also started the RW & Co clothing company and has launched a production company. What a successful farmer! 1. Jonathan Taylor Thomas The child actor rose to fame by playing Randy Taylor on Home Improvement and voicing the young cub version of Simba in Disney's Lion King. Hollywood soon wondered where the talented actor faded away to and the answer, to pursue his studies. Did you know Jonathan Taylor is as smart as he is talented? After studying philosophy and history at Harvard University for two years, he spent his last few years of college life at St. Andrews University in Scotland. JTT hasn't been on the red carpet for over 15 years, and we're still waiting to see the floppy-haired actor return to our TV screens. Which celebrity were you shocked to see have a normal career off-screen? Let us know down in the comments below, and make sure you subscribe to our channel and give us a like, and don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you never miss a video.